Hey y'all, what's up? Alright, welcome, welcome back, whatever. Um, we are here today for another cow pack review, but this one's gonna be a little bit different. So I have three, actually four bags here that I've been asked a couple questions about, so I thought I would just make a video um, kind of comparing all four of them. Um, there's two in particular that have been hot topics. One, not so much, and the fourth, definitely not at all. Um, but I thought what I would do is just kind of compare uh, the four bags um, and then do a little packing test to see what all I can fit in each bag. So the first bag we're going to be reviewing, not reviewing, discussing, comparing, is the Luca Duffel. And I do have my little mini um, key pouch attached right now. So this is the regular Luca Duffel in oatmeal. This is a true weekender bag. It's got the crossbody strap. It's got a hidden shoe compartment over here and a pocket right here. Um, when I used this a couple weeks ago for a one night weekend trip, um, I put my water bottle in this pocket. So I've already done a full review on this bag. So I'm just going to kind of hit the high points. It has a trolley sleeve. It is this kind of like nylon puffy material. I don't know if it's nylon, it might not be nylon. Um, and then the inside is all black. It has two kind of shoe compartments over here on this side, zipper, mesh pocket on the other side. So that is the first bag that we're gonna be talking about. Okay, the second bag is the Luca XL duffel or the large duffel. I've not done a review on that one yet, but it's gonna be pretty much the same thing as the regular Luca, except obviously this is the XL size. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see this size comparison, but here's the XL. Here's the regular. So the XL is quite a bit bigger. Kind of hard to tell, I know, but the XL, it is bigger. Um, I will look up the dimensions for you. Okay, so the regular Luca Duffel is a packing capacity of 22 liters. I don't really know what that means. Um, 12 inches by 16 inches by seven. So that is the dimensions of this bag. And again, this is an oatmeal. Okay, the Luca large duffel is 15 by 19 by nine and a half. And it has a packing capacity of 45.5 liters. Again, I don't know what that means. But that is the difference in the measurements for the regular Luca versus the large Luca. It has the same trolley sleeve on the back. Um, fun fact, I did not realize this at first. The trolley sleeves do have a zipper pocket. That was one of my gripes, no longer a gripe. Um, it has a much larger water bottle pocket than the regular Luca and still has your shoe compartment, zipper on the front. It also does come with the crossbody strap and Wow, that's, this is a big bag. Um, same pocket situation it looks like. So two kind of stretchy pockets. Um, a larger mesh pocket on this side. And a all the way across, all the way down zip pocket on the side where the stretchy pockets are. Um, oh, this is nice. It has another um, stretchy pocket in here on this side on the water bottle side. So that's really nice. This bag is going to be, for me, a real weekend bag. The regular Luca is more of an overnight bag. All right, the third bag we are going to be looking at is the ex expandable, I almost said extendable, expandable laptop tote. I cannot say enough good things about this bag. I am obsessed with this bag. 
I have been using this exclusively as a work bag. I don't have any of my work things in here right now. I took them out for that, this video. Now that I'm kind of thinking about it, I probably should have left them. I might stick them in here and see, I don't know. We'll kind of see how the packing goes. But um, this bag, side pocket, again, I've done a full review on this one. Um, the main feature of this one, it's expandable. So it does, it's hard to do this with one hand, <laughs> expand up to four inches. And this and I, the Luca large are in the cho uh, color chocolate. So I really love this bag. Lots of pockets on the inside. Also has a trolley sleeve. So this is really nice. Um, this one has a dedicated laptop sleeve. That's going to be a big difference between the Luca and the duffel and the laptop's uh, tote. This has a dedicated padded laptop sleeve because it's marketed as a laptop tote. Um, it's got lots of pockets. Obviously on the laptop side, it's just the laptop pocket. Then there are two stretchy pockets on the other side and a full zipper pocket. Then you, like I mentioned, you have the pocket over here. So this is a great bag. Okay, the fourth bag, I'm kind of throwing a little curveball, but it wouldn't be fair to do a comparison of all the cow pack, like totes, overnight bags, weekend bags, duffels, whatever you want to call them, without including, I call this the Steven, it might be the Steven, I don't know, but this is the Steven. Um, I took this bag with me to Hawaii. So um, I haven't necessarily done a full review on it, but if you're interested, you can go check out my Unpack With Me video to hear a little bit about this bag um, and why I probably would not take it again as this actually worked as my personal item, believe it or not. Um, but probably why I would not take it again in that situation on a plane to Hawaii, a major trip, whatever. Um, but this is a great bag, very durable. And the great thing about this one is it has this compartment at the bottom for shoes, toiletries, whatever. I put shoes in here. Um, probably the reason I would not take this bag again is it doesn't have a pocket in the actual bag that goes all the way down. And I did not think about that until it was too late. But again, it's a great bag. It's a very, very durable. It worked fine. It just isn't probably my ideal bag um, as a personal item. But we'll see if it's gonna work well um, as a weekend bag. We are in my guest bedroom. We are going to pretend I'm going on a, I hope that's focused, I don't know. Um, anyway, we're gonna pretend I'm going on a weekend trip. I have my pajamas, one, two, two regular outfits, um, a pair of leggings and bike shorts and a like athletic top, um, a pair of tennis shoes, a pair of sandals, and then my laptop, which is also in a cow pack, laptop sleeve. Um, and I think that's it. And a sweatshirt. Um, we're gonna pretend I'm leaving on Friday night. I'm wearing this outfit, it's just a little white sweater, black joggers, and vans. <laughs> so anyway, let's test our first bag. Okay, we're gonna start with the Luca, the regular duffel. Um, what you need to remember is to put your shoes in first. So I'm gonna unzip this shoe pocket and put my tennis shoes in there. Kinda have to finagle them. And there is a little buckle in here that you kinda have to unbutton um, to use this for shoes. So, my two shoes are in. I could probably fit my sandals in there. So, yep, 
there we go sandals fit all right zip that up now one thing with this it takes up a good amount of room in this bag so you have to be a little bit strategic about how you're packing so again this is a full weekend trip um i'm going to take these undergarment type things and socks and kind of stick them in strategically um and then i think let's just start packing so bike shorts leggings athletic top um second outfit shirt and shorts and we're pretending i'm going when it's a little bit warmer i guess actually that was my first outfit second outfit shirt and shorts Okay, it's getting a little crammed in here, but we're gonna continue. Okay, and I have my, a pair of silky pajamas, just a t-shirt and shorts, put that there. Okay, getting close. Um, I have a sweatshirt set out because I'm a sweatshirt traveler that might not fit. So all of my skincare, not all of it actually, this is my, what I can't live without for a weekend. Um, and you know what, I didn't bring a hair tool, hold on. Okay, got my flat iron, it's versatile. I slide that right in there. Hairbrush, my toothbrush. And then I have this little bag that is just Q-tips and cotton balls, cotton rounds. Um, okay, so we're pretty much at capacity. Unfortunately, the laptop didn't fit, but here's what we're looking like. So we'll see if we can zip it. And there we go. Okay. I'm impressed. I was not sure, sorry about the glare. <laughs> um, I was not sure if all of that was gonna fit in the Luca, but I'm, I'm impressed. So now let's try the Luca large duffel. I'm unpacking, but I also wanted to say there is still room in this water bottle pocket for a water bottle. Apologies, one more thing. Uh, there was nothing in the any of the pockets. So all of those pockets were still um, open. All right, it's time to let the big boy shine. Let's pack the Luca large duffel. Same items. Okay, make sure I got everything. Here is the Luca Large, all packed. Plenty of room left. I'm gonna zip it up. Um, nothing in the water bottle pocket, still plenty of room. Um, let me show you what size we're looking at here. I mean, yeah, we're talking about a big bag. Um, I'm 5'2", so this is a big bag. Also, I got the sweatshirt in this bag. Next up, the laptop tote. I'm gonna start with it um, normal, so not expanded, and then we'll see what we get. Obviously, I'm gonna take my laptop out of the case for this one and put it in the pocket. This is, for reference, this is a 13 inch MacBook Air. I don't know if you can see that, but there is plenty of room. It would easily fit a 15 inch 
um, laptop. So, nervous. I'm nervous about this one. All right, here we go. So I did not have that expanded all the way. Um, but without the shoes, here's what we're looking like. So it's getting a little close, but I think we did it. It didn't have a sweatshirt, but we did it y'all. Here we go. So I wasn't expecting that, but it fits. I don't know if the way everything is packed in there is my preference. I prefer a little more room because I don't like digging for everything, but I'm shocked. I did not get the tennis shoes in either, but that could be a situation where you could you know, sacrifice your outfit that you're going in a little bit and maybe wear your tennis shoes there if you know you want your tennis shoes. I don't know, wear your sweatshirt. Kind of depends, right? Okay, last but not least, let's try and pack the Steven before my camera dies. I can't get it zipped, but this fit everything too. Um, okay, my camera did die, sorry about that. We're gonna finish it up here. Um, I, I'm shocked that these bags all fit everything, um, especially the laptop coat. That one kind of came out of nowhere. Um, but if you have questions about these bags, let me know. Um, I, they're all great bags, truly. You cannot go wrong with a cow pack. Um, great quality it's gonna last forever I took this one like I said to Hawaii and back um, dragged it around all over I've been using the work uh, the laptop tote for work great bags I do have a code in the description box for $25 off an order of 150 or more um, feel free to use that if not no worries um, but like I said, let me know if you have questions. Um, I don't know how helpful this was, if at all. Um, but if you have additional questions or things you want me to look at, let me know. Happy to help and I hope you enjoyed.